Hello, this is a short instructional video on how to set the limits on a model 2400 source meter. The model 2400 source meter has limits that you can set for voltage, current, or resistance readings and the limits can be used as a pass-fail kind of a test. Here's how to configure very simple limits. First thing you do is choose a function. I have a 1K resistor on here, so let's choose resistance. First I would measure it. Notice it's about 1K, but it's 0.994K. Keep that in mind. Alright, let's turn it off and configure the limits. So to configure limits, you'd press the config button, then the limit button. Let's go to hardware limits and explain that in just short. Hardware limits on this source meter is the compliance value. If you want to uh, put a limit on what the compliance is or when it fails, this is the one you would use, the hardware limit. Control is easy enough. It's enable or disable. Fail mode, if you go to that and hit enter, it means do you want to fail when you're in compliance or when you're out of compliance? Simple enough. But the one that's mostly used are the software limits. Software limits, you have quite a few of them. If you go into in, limit 2 through 10, I believe. Sorry, 12. Okay, so let's choose just 2. So you could have well, those 10 separate, 10 total from 2 to 12. So let's go to limit 2. Control, easy enough. Enter, we just enable it. Now we select the limits. Let's go to the low limit. And it comes up to minus 1. Well, that's no good for resistance, but we know this was 0.994K, so let us just change that. We'll change it plus, go to the range, go up to oh, about 1K, down, over. Let's just say 0.9K. That would be lower than what it is. So that's the low limit. Hit enter. It asks you for the digital out pattern of 15. You could anywhere from 0 to 15. Hit enter. We do the same thing with the high limit. Enter. 1. Well, let's just go up to 1K. Now it's at 1K. Hit enter. We'll keep the digital I.O. pattern at 15. We'll go into that in another video. Enter exit. Now, the thing that people forget is when you turn this on, you say, gee, it's within limits and nothing's happening. Okay, that's true, but you have to remember to turn on the limits here. Even though we did the control within the menu, we have to hit limits on. Oh, look, now that it's on, it says pass. How do you know that it's working? Well, let's just take this out overflow. That's higher than the 1K we set up. It says fail. Notice compliance goes also. So that's how you do this limits. It's very simple to set up. 